Welcome in. I'm Mr. J. This is the arcade. We're playing Tears of the Kingdom. So let's get into it, shall we? All right. Last time we did some Gorani things. We fought a weird spider thing. And uh, this guy seems to have a mission for us. So I remembered something about that other Zelda. When we were mining marbled rock roast on the north side of Death Mountain, she said something kind of funny. She told me not to go near the lizard lakes, but she didn't say why. A bit surprised to hear her say, hear the words lizard lake coming out of your craw. Don't hear much about them lakes these days. I still recall an old nursery rhyme about them. One brother hunts what other brother hides. Two lizards fighting over what's inside. Not everyone knows this, but the lizard lakes are also called the lizard brothers. I searched high and low for them back in my younger years. Always thought treasure might be there somewhere. Then on my hunt, Death Mountain blew its top and was covered in lava before you could say boom. Boy, I'd forgotten all about my search for the lakes. That's it. Talking about this has me all worked up. It's been a real long time, but I'm ready to start the hunt again. Best place to start looking is halfway up Death Mountain. My hunch, is, my hunch way back when it led me to the north side. There's a Yonobo code dig site there, too. We can hop in minecart and get cracked. This dude's poor back. <laughs> My aching back. Hey guys, I was already there and I got oh. the treasure. Equipment named after a divine beast. What a red hot treasure. Since the lava cooled, I always wondered if something might find them. Not only did you do it, you found the treasure to boot. You're your Nobo's partner, all right. <laughs> Wish I could go back in time and tell my spry younger self that Lizard Brothers really do exist. I feel a real sense of fulfillment hearing this. Thanks for sharing the good news. The Lizard Lakes don't seem like a dangerous place. Maybe I misunderstood when I was told not to go near them. Even if I can't do much, I'll search this area some more and get some answers about Princess Oda. Cool. Wow, we got that already. That was one of our divine beast helmets that we already had collected so now we have two of <laughs> all right let's take a look at the map what do we want to do got a few little shiny bits but we really need to head down in this neck of the woods to see about the original phenomenon -mana. So let's go check out the Gerudo Desert, shall we? Phenomena, phenomena, phenomena. Do 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 do. Sorry, it was a weird day at work. Just don't mind me. Oh. <laughs> uh. uh. Are you hot, Link? I think we've got stuff for that. That we're already equipped in. So how is it that we're in the hot suit and you're still hot? Yeah, see, that's cold resistance. Flame resistant rocks and fireproof boots. I guess I don't have anything that would be considered heat resistance. Hmm. We have some food for that, maybe? are all just for like a minute. Here we go. There you go, my boy. Maybe we'll be able to get some clothes inside that'll help you out. Uh, yeah, that's weird. I thought I would be able to march right on in here with this. I guess that's not the type of resistance we were looking for. 
I don't think they're going to let me just waltz in here. It has become high. You can take damage with your current outfit and food effects. Okay. Oh. Maybe I can just waltz right in here. None of the damage. That'll take care of it, though. A Gibdo bone. Alright, I'm slightly concerned. This place is in really rough shape. What are you doing up there? I can almost guarantee you are a Yiga person. Oh. <laughs> Another voice. Wait, what? Who are you? like Markiplier tall. Holy smokes. What is that over there? You're just another real living person. I was certain one of the ghosts haunting this place had come for me. I traveled out here hoping to meet the wonderful, amazing Gerudo women who lived here, but there's no one. I do sometimes hear voices coming from the wall, the wells. Ah. ah. Obviously, the place is now haunted by the restless spirits of the beautiful Gerudo who were slain in the strange monsters. If I'm not careful, the same monsters might get me, too. What is that? I got a ball. A Gerudo spear. Ha 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 ha. What the ball does, because you know the ball's going to do something. I guess we could go down there. That's not good that they're taking two hits. Hey, look at me. I'm a shopkeeper now. Yay! Sand seal. Okay. Yeah, not taking any of the business from any undead nasties. That was a lizard. I thought it was more arrows. Can we go in here? Oh. Hey, Perta, you made sure the entrance was really secure block, right? <laughs> yeah. It's very much completely blocked with a crate. Yeah. Keep it down. What do you think's going to happen if those monsters outside hear us? I really need to get more arrows. I have run drastically low. Ah, get off of there. Just read the thing. Construction and service net. In regard to work, hole in the floor. Due to lack of resources, a large stone slab has been used to temporarily seal the... Ah! So what you're saying is... If I do this... 
we can go down the hole. Well, we gotta explore more first. I explore, I mean loot everything we can. It's so shiny. Oh, it's a torch. Yes, there's not gonna be anything good in here. This place is really in shambles. How many years have passed between adventuring in Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom? Has anyone come up with that yet? There's a Gerudo lady there. Fountains have run dry. What does the chair say? Come on, let me read the chair. You're not gonna let me sit in the chair either. That that's disappointing. over here I can blow up with some light arrows? No. Fine. Let's read you's diary. Cool. See unsettling the report. Strange haze called a gloom. Emanating from beneath Hyrule Castle, those who touch or fall ill. My friends Link and Zelda are in Hyrule. I'm sure those two can get to the bottom of this. New, much more worrying report. Both Link and Zelda have gone missing. Shortly after they were lost, castle lifted in the sky, where it was joined by countless small floating islands. So much happening all at once. What is going on in the world? And who are those two safe? More and more dire across Hyrule. Now the danger has come here as well. A sand drought, the worst sandstorm in recent memory, has covered the area. People are taking shelter underground. We traveled out to see if we could discern the cause of it, but we were ambushed by new monsters called Gibdos. To make matters worse, I wasn't able to accurately hit them with the lightning I can call down. We were inundated with the seeking safety from the sand shroud and the Gibdos, and we still don't know what has caused this. As the chief of Gerudo Town, I am to blame for these failures. Fortifications protecting the shelter are strong. There's no way monsters will be able to break through. Cool. Also lucky to have a good source of water in the shelter, but we must watch for invaders trying to use the waterways. And as a precaution, we should cover the hole behind the throne. Mer. Sitting here feeling sorry for myself won't solve anything. I'm going to leave Beleria to in charge of the shelter and go train. The ruins to the north aren't too far. They should be perfect place for me to practice with my lightning. Despite my worries for my people and for the world, I must do what I can. I know that's what Zelda would advise me to do. Oh, Lady Urbosa, if only you were here with us. Watch over all of us in these dark times and keep Zelda and Link safe. It's nice that she wants me to be safe. He has a nice library. I knew I liked her. She has hard leather bound books too. It's like my entire library. <laughs> okay, some kind of hole behind the throne. Means. Fine. 
You don't have to kick me out of town. You know who I am. Huh? Oh, we're not to be permitted to be here. You must leave at once. Oh. Hold on. Lyra. It has been some time, swordsman. It's all right. This one has the chief's permission to enter. He is welcome to visit any of the shops and businesses. Spread the word. Let everyone know this is the case. Oh. For you to come all this way, and during the strange storm that plagues us, you must have some important news to share. Oh, really? I can wave my hand like this. Princess of Hyrule is still missing. We had heard the events at Hyrule Castle, but this... Things are dire indeed. Still swordsman. I mean, Link. I'm impressed you made it here through the storm that surrounds Gerudo Town. Mm. The sand trout settles, settled on us some time ago. We set out patrols to try and determine what was causing it, but a swarm of monsters, creatures called Gibdos, suddenly appeared, attacked our troops, and forced us to retreat. Gibdos have even made their way into the town. As a result, everyone was evacuated to this shelter for their safety. As someone charged with protecting Gerudo Town, I am ashamed at our current situation. You do look sad. Don't take it so hard. This is all to say that, although I wish I could help you search for the princess, now is not a good time. I'm sorry. Mm. Lady Riju is currently training. She is trying to become strong enough to save us from this disaster. If you are hoping to speak with Lady Riju, you should visit the ruins to the north. Hello. Aww. You're very fair-skinned for Gerudo. Am I wrong? What? What do you want? I'm I'm busy right now. I need to make sure the vow of my dreams hears my feelings for him. How can I properly focus with the positive energy or put the bottles in the water? Or put the bottles in the water while this guy is loitering around. Uh -huh. Get out of here. Scram. Oh, messages in a bottle. I get you. Okay. I was totally confused. I'll take them all. I'll take everything you got, actually, while I'm here. You know, support the local economy and small mm. business and... Not that I was looting the town earlier. <laughs> oh. mm. Thank you, ma'am. You got mushrooms, you got salt. The little kids are following me around. <laughs> Is everybody okay? Y'all aren't in like a ton of trouble, are you? I don't want to blow up in that wall, but I wonder if this cannon is for that. Ah, be careful. Can't tell when someone is deeply focused on dangerous task. Cannons demand the utmost care when handling. I may only be practicing right now, but if my hand slipped, I could set off the cannon. Huh? Don't talk to me again. Could be bad. Really bad. <clears throat> I mean, that cannon's opened at the door that I want to go through. What is this? I see lightning coming down and striking a thing, and there's three weird pillar things. That might be the, uh, the little light beam thing that we saw earlier, which I remember we were investigating those in an earlier episode. Ooh, what's this way? <laughs> it's the love class. <laughs> oh my god, look at the face. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, the this I can't. No, the, this was funny as all get out in Breath of the Wild. I love their approach to teaching about Vo. Uh, hey, it's like a little mini version of the. Is this going to be important? Do I need to do this again? Could I screenshot any of this? Yeah. Just in case. There, we've got all of them. Uh-oh, I upset the seal. That's not good. Hey, money. We like money. Should I go? Mm. Oop, the chief is okay. Maybe I should go after her. But I'm just the attendant to Patricia. I'd be acting against her wishes, too. If I were to go, th though, I could just go through here. It comes out at the northern room. Oh, hey! Yeah, who's Patricia? I don't oh. remember a Patricia. Ooh. Oh. Sand seal. I've heard of the sand seals, right? Yeah, I, I remember. She kind of has the power of an oracle. Oh. Or he did. Ever since the upheaval, she's mostly just been sharing these strange numbers. I've been her attendant for years now, but even I can't make sense of the term, oh. but she's off with the chief right now. They're headed to the northern ruins. If you speak with Patricia, you'll probably have to wait until things have settled down if, and the chief isn't so busy. Ooh. Train with the Northern Road, right out here with Patricia. Mm. A lot of strange monsters. Eh. Possible to navigate there. She's a made sense of direction, but I'm not so lucky. So instead of traveling above ground, I was thinking of using this secret passage. Mm. Can't stop myself from worrying about the chief. I wish this Vo would go and check on her for me. At least then I'd be able to rest a little easier. Well, you know what, Pata? Wish granted. Only a silent statues. That's a cool name. What's up, my dude? Granted you the power to summon his avatar. Okay. Is the whole gang here? No? Where's the... Where's my little bird friend? He should be here. <laughs> There he is. Strange. I'm sure it is. Oh, that's not good. the look of any of that down there. This looks like a way to climb up. So... <laughs> we'll do it the easy way. What's that? Reflector of light. I see. Uh, 
That's so cool. So let's see how this mirror shieldy kind of deal works. Temp, how's it going? Good to see you. I'm uh, attempting to puzzle solve at the moment. Oh, we have to aim it up at the thing. This is going to be very complicated, isn't it? I'm going to have to bounce light all over the place. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that should be the subtitle of this game. Is I don't know if it's how I was supposed to do it, but that's how I did it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I got it. No. That did not work either. I wonder how I got the other one. <laughs> because I think that's the right place oh maybe you just have to hold it on there long enough for it to do a thing okay that that's slightly more sense I guess <laughs> So this looked like it just pulled back a little bit. What was that noise? Yeah, the hell is that? I want this bomb flower. Because I have a feeling these are going to be required. Hydrate, you bastard! Hydrate! A hydrate, you say? It is that time. So, here we go. Thank you, Temp. Oh, I wonder if this guy can... Uh, <laughs> drop that lizard into the abyss. That's exactly what he did. I wanted to see if he could the ore. Not you. Oh, he can. Nice. I dig it. Well, yeah, it's a two liter. I mean, what else would I be drinking? Is that all? Just the bubble? Okay, fine. What's in the other statue? Yeah, with as expensive as cans are right now, I just decided to go with the two liters. What else we got in here? I see you little mirror piece get out of there so now i have two of these think right about here
Um, because I don't normally drink regular water on camera. <laughs> I gotta be like hip and cool and do what all the cool kids do, you know? Soda and all that fun stuff. Okay, now I've got a light beam I can work with. Now I have my little like pitcher thing here, but I need to wash it. But I normally just have water in there. Ooh, are we going to be able to cut this angle? Oh, Jesus. Definitely not what I wanted to do. Where'd my little mirror go? Crap. Yeah, that mirror is long gone. Oh, wow. Actually, come to think of it, I was drinking normal water last night. I had like a nice big glass of it with me. Messing around with Minecraft. Trying out the new update and trying to find a cherry forest thing. By the time I finally found one, I got killed by a baby zombie. I was not happy. Oh, jeez. Really? Oh, there's the mirror. Drifted way the heck over here. Can I put you up there? That could totally be a thing. climb up there, maybe. Still grab it from here. Ah, there it is. <laughs> 
that's how you get the mirror shield nest to it. Can't seem to change direction, though. You can only face, like, one way. Okay, I get you. Crap. I could have fused that one that's down there to my shield and left this one up here. This doesn't let you aim very well at all. So yeah, I've got to figure out how to get that one back up here. Uh... aren't I? like two more people then we can open up the discord we're at like 98 Not that I'm the cause of the trouble, but I can wave my hands like this and it explains everything. <laughs> so Hyrule Castle rose up into the sky, so it vanished right in front of you. Now you've come here looking for clues. Hmm. Link, I understand how you're feeling. So does dear friend to me as well. I will do everything in my power to help you. But to do that, I need to bring quick resolution to the problem we Gerudo are facing. I'm sure you've noticed that the desert is even more difficult to cross than usual. It's thanks to this unusual sand trout. It appeared around the same time the events in Hyrule Castle took place. It has blanketed the whole desert, including our town. And not long after that, swarms of monsters we'd never seen before began attacking. We're calling them Gibdos. 
Physical attacks don't work well against them. They are slow, but they make still make investigating the same trout difficult. Were you watching just now? Maybe. Hmm. I've been practicing striking that dummy over there with lightning. If I can aim the lightning well, I think it may be an effective weapon against the Gibdos. Hmm. But this technique is unrefined. I only recently discovered it, and I still need more practice. I want to master this power so I can use it to defeat the Gibdos. If I can do that, we can investigate the source of this sand trout and search for Zelda as well. Hmm. Link, will you help me with my training? I think I can use your arrows to help me aim my lightning strikes. Fire one at that dummy over there. But I'm out of arrows. At least I think I'm out of arrows. Oh no, I just, my bow broke. Ha, ah, there we go. Now let's try something a little trickier. Hmm. Aim for those dummies over there. Maybe we can hit them with a single lightning strike? Here's an idea. Don't try to hit a specific dummy. Instead, aim for the area in the middle of all three, like right around where that rock is jutting out. Oh, but keep in mind that the farther away the target is from me, the longer it will take me to build up the energy to hit it. Did we do it? Yeah. <laughs> yes! I'm getting the hang of it now. Ooh. Gipdos don't stand a chance against this power. Oh? Well, maybe she's not that much taller. I can't thank you enough for your help, Link. I think maybe she just looked taller in the wider shot. But she's like one of the only people in the mm. game that isn't as tall as Link. What was that? Mm. It didn't sound like any noise the sand crowd has made, that's for sure. You heard that too, right? It was... <laughs> Chief! We've received word that a swarm of Gibdos are attacking Kara Kara Bazaar. Belira is already on her way there. Hmm. She's already? Okay, understood. Thank you. Hmm. Link, we need to head to Kara Kara Bazaar at once. I must ask for your help once again. My lightning and your guiding arrows make a formidable pair. Do you remember Kara Kara Bazaar? It's in the oasis northeast of Gerudo Town. Let's see how those Gib... Or let's show those Gibdos what we're made of. Yeah, let's do that. As soon as I eat something that will keep me cool for a little while. Dang, I was hoping that would stack. Oh, we're like deep in the thick of it, are we? Where are we going? I don't know where I am. There's still time to loot. I can loot. A knight's bow. Okay. And a bunch of arrows. We like the arrows. heat, even with the heat resistance. Alright. 
This is a bad idea, but we're going in. Ah. That was quite helpful, actually. <laughs> Because yeah, I didn't finish looting over on this side. Let me in. What was that move, Link? Letter are the Vaux I fated to meet, and I am the Vi you were destined for. You must hurry and rescue me. I am locked away from the outside world. Do not worry, though. I will send all of my love to you until you come and find me. Stay safe and know that we will meet soon. It is our destiny, after all. Aww. That is so cute. <laughs> <laughs> She's just chucking them down the well. Tell me they all say the same thing. Yep. <laughs> oh, man, that, that is... Wait a minute. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I can't put the love letter on the end of my weapon. That that would have been absolutely precious. Oh, she's got little flowers tied to them too. Can I climb this rope? That would be convenient. All right, all right. kind of thing. Alright. Where is the bazaar? Up this way. So I think right there. Or at least in that neck of the woods. this 
I don't understand what that did. Chest in here, though. This is a weird looking formation. For you. This dandelion thing is about. I need to get you somewhere? Thanks. You're doing it to make me mad now, aren't you, Link? Just, just in spite of me. did not work the way I thought it would. <laughs> this will. You know, you're in my way.
Treasure chest. Knight's broadsword. Seven. Oh, it's better than this one. That was not worth coming down here for. So I'm guessing there's something better on the other side, but. to the tornado because at least then I can get a bird's eye view of what the heck's going on oh hey I see a thing and we're right there okay cutscene love the design of these. Don't let any more gift outs. Ah, help doesn't arrive soon. Whew. Sorry to keep everyone waiting. I needed to make a dramatic entrance. I'm here now, and we're going to wipe all Gibdos out at once. Yes. Follow me! Link, don't let me down. Oh, don't look at me like that. These monsters stand no chance. Okay. <laughs> Tell me this is the ability you get with her, because this is sick. Oh, what is that? Oh, they're the beginnings of mushrooms. That are probably summoning these guys. <laughs> oh, this is great. I absolutely want this ability. What else we got? Oh, that's it? No more? Bulyara, well done holding the line until we were able to get here. Now that we know the Gibdos are susceptible to lightning, this gives us a major advantage. Huh. It does. And I like the way that Riju says her name, because I could never figure it out. Is that Zelda? No. <laughs> I swear, the first time you get to see this Zelda's face, it's just going to be Ganondorf with, like, a Zelda wig. And I'm going to be so mad. That's bad. 
real bad. It's not that bad. Gerudo Town is in danger. Nah. It'll be fine. I've seen it already. Zelda, wait! She was heading directly toward those tornadoes. And if more Gibdos are hiding in the storm... Bulyara, we need to get back now. <laughs> Bulyara. Wait. We're going on ahead. I'll meet you in town. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll see you in town, kiddo. Just as soon as I unlock this thing, maybe do a little shopping while I'm here. I swear, I'll be right there. What is that sword on my back? I don't recognize it. What am I equipped with? Oh. Knight's Broadsword. Okay. Yeah, I didn't recognize that scabbard. Hey, there's a chest. A couple of chests. What should I use? <laughs> huh. Oh, and errors if you need them. You can trust me with it. Okay. She said to style, she'd decorate a weapon, but I just don't know how to approach this quest. She told me to make it sparkle and that it must radiate burning passion. But I don't know what she's talking about. Top it all off. She's got all. An allergy to monsters, so that means monster parts won't do. Uh, if I had a weapon I could use as reference where to start, that would help a lot. Um... Oh. We got 25? Well, hell, we'll get rid of this one then. Give me all the arrows. Uh, oh, these are some of the remains. The epic battle we just fought. But it's fine now. Oh. Another Gerudo bow. Wow. I think we'll get rid of this one. Because I know the other one had. Um, attack power, but I think that one gives you like a super straight shot. Alright, so what I'm thinking for this young lady is one of these and radiate burning passion. I don't know what to do. What about this? Oh. Something isn't quite... I don't know if I'm getting the sparkle. The burning passion from what you've done. Huh. Still. 
do appreciate. Okay, so I've got to get one of my sparkly fruits. That's fine. Oh, seared steak. I'll take all of them. What else you got? Roasted bass? Heck yes. Nice. <laughs> Last one? All right, I'll take it. Desert bow had been, yes. Uh, sure. <laughs> Since you're kind enough to buy the last one, I'll keep my promise and tell you that secret. <laughs> the headband you just bought is only part of the Desert Bow series. It's also a spalder and trousers. Go to a special place to get them. Have you heard of the store Fashion Passion in Gerudo Town? Well, the secret shop is located behind that store. <laughs> oh, now that I think about it, Vo aren't allowed in Gerudo Town. Forget I said anything. Okay. <laughs> hey. Oil jar? Yeah. Why not buy them all up now? How many you want? I'll take them all. I can get used to this. Look at all these hydromelons. Please be safe. Yeah, man, please. Have you seen the fellow with scruffy beard around here? No. Uh. Sorry, that was rather abrupt. We're the caravan squad, merchant crew, hoping to trade at Gerudo Town. Our friend Pontos has uh, disappeared. Car Car Bazaar was attacked by the monsters. We all ran, taking refuge in the inn. I thought Pontos was with us the whole time. But when we finally caught our breath, he was nowhere to be found. Aww. Between the storming sands and the rush of people, everything was a chaotic blur. I could barely see a thing. But I think I caught a glimpse of Pontos running out through the West Gate entrance. Mm. Yeah. If we get lost in the desert, our squad's role is to wait for a secure place that stands out, like near a tall building. There are a lot of sinkholes in this desert. They can really trip you up. Don't even want to think about what would happen if you fell in. Chances of finding him should be low enough without the sand shroud, but with it, please be okay, man. Eat. Uh, Maybe I'll go look into that. Maybe I won't. Uh -huh. Give me all the arrows. Uh. Is that all you uh. got? Thanks to the Sandra. Investigate the ruins. Can say some heat and cold night mess with my skin, so I figured I'd take some time off at the spa. Uh -huh. the Sandra, I can't get to Gerudo Town. Just the worst. Hmm. Okay, I'm fine now. Turn and frown upside down. No wrinkles, just have unfurled my brow. Which I do, no sweat. If I could just take advantage of that spa plan. Oh. Uh -huh. Skilled esthetician in Gerudo Town named Roma. Fluffy beds here are great and all, but I hear Roma's spa plan is something else entirely. Apparently nothing else can make you feel as relaxed and refreshed as it does. Just want to soothe my poor skin and bone-tired body. Excavating Dig Dog Bridge has been exhausting. I know. Just turn this frown upside down. No wrinkles. Just unfurl my brow. Wait, Gerudo Town isn't in danger, right? What if Roma was attacked by those weird monsters before in his heart? No, no. Even if she were attacked, monsters like that wouldn't stand a chance against Roma's special technique, right? I don't know, maybe. Is that uh, three big ideas? Uh, no. I want to buy more things. Who are you? Well, first, let's throw this on. Because that should at least help a little bit with the heat. Ah. Uh. Be 
Beetle. Yeah. My man, I haven't seen you in ages. Nice. Good job, Temp. What are the chances I run into you here? Uh, what do you got? Give me arrows. Give me all the arrows. I'll take all of these two. Shock fruit. Maybe a shock fruit. There is a well. What's in the well? It had crabs. These is it. <laughs> Just blow myself up. It's all good. It's one of you. Probably just goes back into the same room. Yeah, it's just right here. Bull and bother. Yeah. 
Ah, what's up? Dude with the scruffy looking beard that we were looking for. I was going to say, if there was nothing down here, I was going to be kind of pissed. What? A person? Where'd you come from? I thought I'd searched everywhere, but I couldn't find a way out of this place. Huh? You made your own path? Yeah, I took a little initiative, you lazy bastard. Oh. You are amazing, my guy. Oh, uh, sorry for shouting. My name's Pontus. I'm a member of the Caravan Squad. Or at least I was. In the os oasis we were guarding was attacked by monsters. I ditched my pals and ran straight into a sinkhole. Oh. Thank you so much. I better hurry back. I'm sure my friends are worried sick. Oh, but I want to give you a proper reward. Drop by Car Car Bazaar when you get a chance. Okay. I'm guessing this is the sinkhole he fell in. No. No way out, huh? Over here. Looks good to me. It really is a sinkhole. And random campfire is random. So we need to go back to the bazaar. I didn't even need to do that. We're right here. Where are those knuckleheads? They're right here. Hi, fellas. Thought I'd drop in. Oh. <laughs> young man saved your life. We all owe him for that. Young man, I'm like 120 years old at this point. Piss off. Thought no matter how many times I hear it, I still can't believe anyone survived falling into a sinkhole. As the leader of the caravan squad, allow me to thank you for bringing Pontos home. Okay. Oh. And as a reward, you're all Yiga members. <laughs> How about this orb, my guy? It has a weird pattern on it. It's probably rare, right? Whatever it is, you know it's cool. Trust me, I'm a merchant. I've got an eye for things like this. I'm going to have to drag these orbs all the way over the place. I know someone in Gruatine is on the lookout for stuff like this, so I was going to see if they could appraise it. But I'll let you have it, my guy. It's the rarest thing I've got, and it's all yours. Take care of it for me. Uh, that sucks. I'm going to have to carry that across the desert. You've got nothing. You've got nothing. You've got nothing. Beetles just over here being beetle. wrong, my guy? Yeah. Sa, sa. What do you got? Yeah, maybe a shock fruit on the end of a... on the end of a weapon. to destroy that fused material. No, I lost the thing that was on the Master Sword. <laughs> Let, let's see if this does the trick for her. Otherwise, it's going to be one of those sparkle fruits. I ran out of those because I was using them to kill the undead. Saba. Mm. Uh. Oh. 
something isn't quite... I don't know if I'm getting the sparkle. The burning passion from what you've done with the weather. Oh. But still. Alright. Fine. Go find one of the sparkle fruits. Like we're missing a couple of the statues from the big ring. I see a dragon. That's probably Zelda. Yeah, that's Zelda. All of her majestic glory. been replaced poorly hmm. ah there you are wondering where you got off to hmm. look link gibdo hive just like the one that appeared at car car bazaar hmm. Hive and those tornadoes were reported to have shown up at the same time, too. But it's not only one hive. There are three to deal with, each one just outside the town gates. I don't need a clairvoyant sand seal to know the massive Gibdo attack is coming. Right now, those hives are durable and nearly impervious to attack. But when they open up and begin releasing Gibdos, they're vulnerable. Gibdos won't wait outside our walls forever. So when they launch their attack, that's our chance to strike. Okay. Uh. Huh? Come. Come. To where I am. Uh. Again, you heard it, didn't you? Come. Is it calling out to us? Mm hmm? Lady Riju, Link, is something the matter? I thought... It's nothing. Link, for now, we should focus on protecting Gerudo Town from the enemies at our gates. We must prepare for battle. Okay. Let us see if we can find... this shop that has the rest of the clothes. I would like some Gerudo Vowear. My little desert adventure here. the same spot the other one was in, right? We're not going down there. It's all just going to lead to the same underground place. Just look around until we can move stuff. 
Yeah, uh, this ball is gonna have one of the symbols of the statues on it. Wait a minute. Crate. Great. Keep it down. Okay. So there is a crate somewhere. this thing in. Weapons, that's the palace. Might be able to score some more arrows down there. no crate around this building that I can do anything with. But right across the street here, get this out of the way, and drop in. And this is absolutely going the wrong way. This is just where I was. Yeah. 
an opal, you say? It's the only thing I can think of. Okay, so we're right here. We need to go that way just a little bit. Maybe here. Ah. Client list check. Products check. Hmm. No. Uh, of oh, but the door is blocked. How did you? Uh, never mind. It's not our role to pry into the business of our customers. You're welcome in our shop, no matter how you manage to make it uh. inside. This is the Greedo Secret Club, the only shop in town that sells clothing designed for Vo in mind. Considering Vo aren't allowed in town, I'm sure you can understand why the shop is a secret. Anyway, that's how we run our business. We're not concerned with who you are. As an outcast myself, I appreciate your business. Well then, let me blow a bunch of money to make it worth your time. Yeah. Oh. I'll take one of those. And one of these. Oh. Cool. Oh. Now I can dress the part. What else you got? Sand boots and snow boots. Hang on a moment. Just warm thing. Uh, I'll take both of these. Oh. No speed up. Oh. 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 Sure. Yeah, what you got back here? Anything good? arrows all right let me out that was a lot more work than I really wanted it to be We are dressed the part, and we are ready to go and tackle whatever this is. We're going to call it quits for the night. So, until next time, keep playing. We all game over sometime, and I will see you around the arcade.